Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel, Anna Bella, and today I'm doing a Warhammer Age of Sigma Mortal Realms review. This time it is issue 73, as you can see, we get one exclusive female figure for the Stormcast Eternals. Let's go to the table and check it out, and also, aren't we just loving my new Entrapped t-shirt? It is so cool. Anyway, moving swiftly on, let's go to the table and check out issue 73. Okay, so here we are at the table. We have the wonderful plastic crack figure that is the blister pack. Look at it, it's so small. And you obviously get one base, which is also very small. Yeah, I've got tie-dye hands. Um, uh, yeah, anyway, so this is issue 73, Warhammer Age of Sigma, Mortal Realms. Let's crack this open first. So here we have the usual contents. So we've got Neve Black Talon from the Stormcast Eternals, a female figure. Ah, gender balancing is happening at a very slow rate in Warhammer, I must say. Chaos, the realms of chaos. But there have always been female figures, just not as many as the blokes, obviously. Destruction, Gloom Sprite Glitz Squigs. There we go. Soul Bright Grave Lords. How to build. Oh, please be easy to construct. Yeah, that's going to be a doddle. I'll get on that. How to paint Neve Black Talon. And then there is her War Scroll, and it's Stormcast issue 21. A well placed axe can shatter armies and topple empires. Her abilities The Hunt. And the hunt battle plan and we also have nine the feast of bones and if i open this out ta-da and then flip over so there we have that now Let's get constructing. Well, I was right, it was easy to build, but it does give you some extra tips regarding the head. It tells you to just clip it out on the spruce, like this, and to keep it there. You also get a Stormcast Eternal ordinary head, as you can see here, just there. Ugh, focusing is just not happening today. But there it is. But this is the one that it wants you to put on with a nice braid, which is so cool. Here is the figure itself, so we have a bird's eye view of it. We spin it round, back view. Two axes she carries. Really, really quick and easy to assemble. Unlike these two, which are going to have a whole video devoted to their trickiness, issue 70 and issue 72 respectively. Oh, OMG, with them. But yes, um, it was really, really quite easy to assemble. Click, 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 and we're done. And it says, don't attach the head just yet, as we make painting it easier after painting your model. Simply click, clip the head off the spruce and glue in. Because it comes with a peg. But it's also, you want to get as much detail as possible on her lovely braid. As you can see from the front of the cover of issue 73. If I flip it over, see, there's the detail. That was a bit quick, sorry about that. And then if I flip it over in issue 74, we will be getting one, two, three Stormcast Eternals and one, two, three, four birds. So Vanguard Raptors and Anther Wings, that is cool in issue 74. And then issue 75 to 78, we get a Mortis engine. OMG, we're getting a vehicle. That is going to be a devil to put together. It's going to be fiddly peeps. Um, just to let you guys know, next week I'm on holiday, so issue 74 will be delayed. We will be having this um, video um, on how I've partway constructed these fiddly diddly dudes for you instead. That's issue 70 and 72. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like, comment and subscribe. And looks like we're going to have more fiddly things to come. Oh, the night haunt fiddly anyway i hope you've enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe and thank you for the support stay safe wherever you are bye